What can you do when a visitor is browsing on your website one moment and gets a strange white screen the next? This is a frequent PHP or database error that's commonly known in the WordPress community as the WordPress white screen of death. This error turns the visitor's screen white and doesn't even give an error code in some browsers. If you're facing this issue on your site, here are four easy steps to fix the WordPress white screen of death. Before we continue, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification icon so you don't miss out on great content related to WordPress and WooCommerce. Poorly coded plugins are common culprits of the WordPress white screen error. In such a case, you can simply go to Installed Plugins in the Plugins section of your WordPress dashboard and deactivate all the plugins using the Bulk Actions drop-down. But if the white screen of death has taken away your access to the admin area, you'll have to deactivate all plugins via FTP. Use an FTP client to connect to your WordPress website and access the WP Content folder. In that, rename the Plugins folder to something else. If this fixes the issue, then enable the plugins one by one to find the root of the issue. Just like plugins, poorly coded themes can also cause the WordPress white screen of death. If you suspect a theme issue, click on Themes under the Appearance tab in your WordPress dashboard. Here, hover over one of the default themes like 2020 and click Activate. If this fixes the issue, reach out to your misbehaving themes creators for help. If you can't access your admin area, you can use an FTP client too. Just connect to your WordPress website and go to the themes folder in WP Content. Save a copy of your current theme on a local drive and delete it. WordPress will automatically switch to a default theme and hopefully, fix the issue. When plugins and themes are not the problem, it's likely a memory limitation has caused a script to quit in the middle. To increase your WordPress memory limit, access your wpconfig.php file via an FTP client. In the file, add this bit of code just before the line that says, that's all, stop editing, happy publishing. The WordPress debug mode will show you all the ongoing errors faced by your website. Just add this code to your wpconfig.php file. After adding it, go to the WP content folder and open the debug.log file to see a log of all errors. If nothing else works, you should disable any integrations to your website within the past 24 hours and get in touch with your hosting provider as well. Combine these steps with the recently added recovery mode feature in WordPress, and you should be able to pinpoint the problem and eliminate the WordPress white screen of death in no time. Check out LearnWoo.com for more articles, videos, and resources related to WordPress and WooCommerce. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our social media channels. And do let us know in the comment section if you want us to cover a specific topic, or if you have any ideas or suggestions.